Hey guys, it's me. Been a minute, long time no see. Long time no see, about probably seven months right now. Then post, probably a few months. Yeah, you guys, I left Yang and I didn't give you a goodbye speech or anything. My apologies. Well, I'm gonna give you some touch up what's happening in my life and what I wanna do with it and not per se to do. But I'm gonna just address this. Long care for me was just to get into the business world, to learn about business, to become an entrepreneur, and feel like I am an entrepreneur, which I am. I pretty much am. But to actually have a taste of what it feels to become this boss, become an entrepreneur, you know? And the only gateway and the easiest gateway to access was lawn care. Lawn care was a nice hobby for me, but throughout my time during lawn care, there's memories that I don't like about myself and what I did. And it's just hard for me to go back to the times of lawn care and not remember that. And now I just don't like lawn care. Of all the burnouts, of all the videos, it wasn't, I don't like anymore. I don't feel like it is a part of my body that has a part of this. It's just how I did things. I overdid it. I was mentally just messed up for a young age. Not like, I'm not trying to be rude, but it's, it felt good, you know? Um, I was just burned out a lot. Just really burned out. And I just don't want to go back to that time of lawn care anymore because now I just have bad memories about it, you know? But I have also good memories. I see that I learned and understand now, and now it's helping me in my life. So I'm happy I did long care. Happy I did something that was a hobby that I learned. Like I learned a lot. <laughs> I learned a lot. And um, yeah, I, I just stopped after a while. After like winter was coming, I just stopped posting. Or after I was doing something else, you know? Yeah, winter. I stopped posting and stuff because I didn't got in class and I had to realize that I don't like it. I just don't like it. I don't like it. I don't want to do something that I don't like. I'm not forced. I'm 16. Like, give me a break. I did a lot. But at the same time, I know I need to push myself even harder. But I'm not going to push myself if I don't like something. Because I'm not going to like it. I'm not going to do it. It doesn't make no damn sense. It's not like I'm starving or anything. I don't need the money. I'm not going to force myself. I'm at that point in my life, I realized that if I don't like it, I don't need to do it. So I decided not to do it. I decided not to post content because obviously I'm not posting anymore on that platform, on that account or anything. And I just stopped. I just went cold trick and stopped. And I'm doing my own thing. Right now, I'm getting some weight, feeling good. Right now, I was I'll give you a little brief summary. I got on a bulk, gained some weight. You know, I told you guys I used to work out on the page. If you remember, I'm obviously working out till this day. I see myself in five years working out. You know, not doesn't change. Um, a lot happened. Um, I talked about nutrition on that platform a little bit, uh, and that comes apart to what I'm gonna discuss today is nutrition coaching. I want to become a nutrition coach. That's my life right now. I realized that uh, during the time of three years since I was 13 overweight. Um, after those two years, I realized that since I was 15, nutrition coach is a possibility because I was very knowledgeable. I learned quick about it. I learned many aspects and it just lead me to more and more opportunities. Now I'm having more and more opportunities today, uh, making this a video. And um, nutrition coaching for me is like my meditation in a way. It's making me focus. It makes me have structure in my life. And no, no, take it back. Not nutrition coaching, just nutrition in general. It makes me have purpose, you know? And yeah, you can laugh at me. I'm 16 years old. Asking about purpose, but it does. Like even though I'm 16, I feel like this is the way, and I'm gonna go for it. Um, it's funny, but I'm not a normal 16 year old kid. You know, it's a lot. Of maybe 16 year kids that aren't entrepreneurs and shit, but you know, I'm not rich or any by means. I'm below middle class. I'm not poor either. You know. Um, I just know that since I was 13, I said, "F it, I'm gonna bust my ass." Cause I knew that I had that. Way to work my ass off. I see many mindsets, many things, but I also see also negatives. But I also see a lot of positives. I'm always in the middle of everything, and I realize that I want to be in the middle, but be in the middle of what I love to do. So I want to get started on the nutrition coaching. I already got started on it. That's all I'm doing now. I'm trying to get clients. Um, also, I'm making videos now. I have a platform that makes videos: Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, YouTube. I have, I'm going to list them all below in the comments if you guys want to check it out. But I am done with lawn care. I do not hate the lawn care industry. I hate how I, I hate lawn care because of my past self, my personal things that I did with lawn care that I don't like. Now, of course, I won't be scared. I'll touch on a lot more. But I don't like lawn care. I just don't like it. It's not because of the sun. It's not because of working hard outside. I go outside every day and day. My whole life is outside. It's just I don't like home care. Some people can't believe it, but if you don't like something, you're not going to do it. <laughs> like, you're not going to do it. 
Just because someone smiles every day or someone like, smiles doesn't mean they like it. They probably smile because they're depressed. They probably smiling because they're sh fucking stressed of how much their body was starving and how much caffeine they were on. So, just because someone's smiling doesn't mean they're freaking happy mentally, you know? But, yeah, guys, if you guys can understand, help me out and go to my YouTube channel, Nutrition Coaching. I'm not quitting on it. I'm going to keep posting to the day I die as long as this and when I become uh, successful and making money. I'm not saying I'm going to be a billionaire, but I'm going to just say I'm going to be making money. I just want to help people. That's it. Like, that's really what I want to do. Not because of self-purpose or any bullshit like that. That's actually my name. No BS. Uh, no BS nutrition. It's just, I want to help people. I realize that I help them on the spot. I just help someone today. Mo many people say I give them some, like, advice, what they can do in the moment of time they got. I'm, I actually like talking to people. It's kind of weird. I thought it was the middle of introvert, extrovert, but I kind of like talking to people, right? But also, I like my own space here or there, but I kind of like talking to people goes along with business, so that's good, communicating. And I just like communicating with people. Maybe because I was inside my house every day since I was 13. You, obviously, a 13-year-old who's obese, who will be playing video games, doing other fat stuff. <laughs> yeah, so so I guess the cages has lifted, the doors have opened, and all my energy comes into this. Very much, I want to start off saying thank you for helping me, guys, for the support of my past self. I learned a lot from Wonker in the business world, and that really helped me and put a touch in my personality to actually do something I love. So I'm going to end off this video. If you guys can please support me on my honor journey of my life, part two, now 16, not 14, or 15, I started, that would be nice. And if you guys need nutrition coaching, obviously I'm going to um, sponsor this video. Just go in the description below. I can, we can discuss privately about nutrition coaching, and I can help you out. And if you obviously have some questions about Lonker, I can try to, you know, tell you. But if you want to discuss about nutrition and your goals and how to succeed them, please, ask any questions. And uh, guys, I'm going to end off this video. Thank you for the love and support. Thank you for all the support in my life. Bye.